Hi, I'm Tony Anscombe from AVG Technologies. Today I'd like to give you a quick walkthrough of our new product, AVG Web TuneUp. Firstly, to get Web TuneUp, you can download it free from our website, avg.com um, slash web tuneup, uh, with a hyphen between the web and tuneup, as you can see here. Once you've in, uh, downloaded and installed the product, you'll be presented with this screen when you first go back into your browser. Uh, and as you can see, the little orange box up here, if we click on this, we need to enable the extension that's been added. So we're giving you some, some help here, and uh, you can see what access we require for the extension. So I'm going to enable the extension now. And as you can see, the AVG logo now appears up here in the address bar. Um, I've now got AVG Secure Search. Um, the first thing that WebTuneUp does is take you through a tutorial. Well, I'm going to close the tutorial, but I would recommend you go through that yourself. Uh, I'm going to close that because I'm going to talk you through the product very quickly. So I can search from here, or I can search from here, and we're, I'm being protected by AVG Secure Search when doing so. But let's look at what actually is in AVG WebTuneUp. We've got site safety, which is first. So you can see whether a page is safe, risky, or dangerous. Um, well, if we go to something, for example, the BBC website, um, as you can see, we're going off there, and it's quite happily going off to that site, and it's going to show me the, the local news. Um, I can also look at the site details. So, for example, if I click more on this site, I can see the website details, last update, the IP address, the speed, etc., etc. Now, I will point out I'm on a, on a very slow Wi-Fi network, which is why my speed is slow here. Um, now, if I, what happens if I click on a site that's uh, less reputable uh, and is dangerous or has malware on it? Um, site safety is now actually going to stop me from going to that domain. So, as you can see here, um, this page actually has a threat on it and it's blocked me. Now I could bypass this going through uh, through the web tune up user interface but obviously this is dangerous it's got malware on it so you, know, you don't want to be here and we can just go straight back to where we were before. So as you can see site safety is providing you a level of protection in your browser that stops you going to infected websites. So if we open the web tune up user interface again what we can also see is we've got Do Not Track in here. Um, Do Not Track allows you to protect yourself from ad networks that may be tracking your searches and displaying relevant ads across different websites. So, for example, when you when you look on search for something in one website, you go to another website and you see similar ads to what you, what you searched for in the previous website. That's because the ads are actually tracking you. Uh, from website to website. So you can actually make some decisions about whether you want to be tracked in that way. So it puts the choice back in your hands. As you can see, it's turned on by de uh, default here. And if I click on more, I can actually select uh, what ad networks I allow, which ones I don't allow. Um, I can also look at social buttons, whether I wish social buttons to be tracking me or web analytics. Um, yeah, it's a complete user choice. As you can see, we make uh, we leave social buttons and web analytics on, uh, and we take off some of the ad networks that have privacy policies that maybe maybe are not in your best interest, or you know maybe you need to decide whether you want to be actually tracked in that way. The other thing that's in uh, Web TuneUp is the browser cleaner. We put all this under one button which is super because if you try and do this within your browser you know, you've got to go through several different steps you've got to clean in different places and maybe not everybody understands how to clean up uh, their browsing history and get the best performance out of their browser so I can click one button here so as you can see I've got one save form 291 cookies 46 websites in my history uh, and I've got no downloads uh, but if I click now as you can see this actually cleans all of my browsing all of my history all of my cookies and all of my saved forms in one go. So a simple one, you know, one click button to do that. Now, I can also select, if I click on the, the settings wheel here, I can also say, well, actually, you know, maybe do not track I don't want turned on or browser cleaner I don't want turned on and, and just run site safety, notifications on or off. Yeah, I can actually select what I want in Web Tuneup active and what I don't want active. Uh, and I can restore to defaults if I wish to do so. Uh, to take it back to, to how it was when it first got installed. Um, and I can select my search and home page here uh, as well. 
So, in conclusion, AVG Web Tune-Up is here, one, to keep you safe. That's the primary goal here in site safety. One, we keep you private with AVG Do Not Track, but also we can uh, increase the performance of your browser by cleaning up all those temporary files and the things get, that get left laying around uh, while you're browsing and, and looking at all the stuff you want to look at. So enjoy using AVG Web Tune-Up, and I look forward to getting your feedback.